Well, I just did my first aluminum melt, and I just started picking stuff up and realized I hadn't taken a video. But, uh, anyways, there's my my mold. I used an ice cream bucket and plaster of Paris, and used a wax thing for the mold. And hopefully, when it's done, it'll look like a kind of like a 1937 Ford sedan. There's my crucible. I used 18 gauge steel on the bottom as a base plate. And uh, you can see there's a bunch of gunk inside there, but that's that's okay. Um, it'll all just melt out in the next melt. But the uh, the furnace it worked pretty good. I don't know if that's too dark to see or what, but it didn't really uh, crack or anything. It held up pretty good. There's, it looks like one kind of a crack, but I didn't put any hot face on it or anything, so it's pretty good. But had a heck of a time getting it tuned up real good. To burn and uh, but once I did, oh man, it was about eight minutes later and we had uh, melt melted aluminum. So but yeah, I think I'm gonna wait for this one to dry or to not to dry to cool. And once it's cool, then um, I'm gonna maybe try and melt some more. I have a bunch more aluminum. I thought I had enough for one of these cars, but it doesn't really look like it. So so anyways, we'll try it after a while. So that's that.